All right, Coach Claire, how just um, coming off a week of uh, a rest, I guess, or just away from, from play in general, uh, I know the start of the season was one you weren't too fond of and the team was, but how, how big was that week off from uh, play to get you guys, you know, back rested, ready uh, to, to continue on with the season? Yeah, it was, it's, it was nice. We were able to train, finally. We haven't been able to train in two weeks during that stretch of games because there's more recovery. And uh, it was nice to take a look and reflect and look at things that we need to work on and improve and put that practice onto the field. So um, it was good for me as a coach, and it was good for the players to to um, get their bodies fresh for the for the New Mexico match. Just um, you know, looking back at those first three, four league games, uh, just one goal. I mean, have you guys kind of pinpointed what the problem is or what the struggle is um, on that end of the pitch, just trying to get the ball in the back of the net yet, or just what's how can that be fixed? Yeah, four of the three games, we, we outshot the opponent, had more shots on goal. Um, just concentration level. Um, the game where we got a point against Monterey Bay was the game that we were that we were outshot and out, uh, outpossessed. So it's a bit ironic on that. But we've talked to our forwards, now having Amando back from international duty, um, I think changes a lot of things. And I think it's a freshness. You saw what Justin Dillon can, can bring when he's fresh against uh, Hartford. And... Um, and getting more out of our wing back. So there, there are certain areas that we talked about and that we need to be dangerous. But we're like I said before in, in previous press conferences, we're very close. So it's about staying on course, and we feel comfortable in what we're doing right now. Now it's just getting getting the points and the deserved points of, of our performances. Personnel-wise, any you know new guys that you're planning on bringing on to the uh, squad, or not the squad, but just planning to have an action on, on uh, Saturday? Yeah, we got Rivas available. Um, he's been training with us, so that's positive. And then the guys, again, right? Jeremy Garay from international duty. Um, Armando's back from international duty, so we have a more full squad. Like I said, it, the, the Vegas game, it's we just played uh, Juarez on midweek, and then we have guys out on international duty. So it's been a tough stretch for us. Looking at New Mexico United, just uh, obviously a big rivalry uh, in the USL. Just uh, what, what's kind of a... The goal is to win, but just what's the approach for your squad considering how the season's been so far heading into Saturday? No, it's to keep doing what we're, we're doing and what we've worked on in this week. So um, we know it's a rivalry match. We had them here at preseason. We saw the intensity that it was not during the preseason game, and we expect that uh, this Saturday in Albuquerque. So we'll put a good match, match plan together. We've had a chance as a staff to really watch them play, uh, which has been more difficult given the prior weeks with the schedule uh, congestion. So we'll be prepared and ready to go and ready to take three points in Albuquerque. I mean, that's the goal and that's the objective. And we know that this is a, this is a big game for us. And I think that, that if we get a good and positive result against New Mexico, we saw what happened last year. And now just looking ahead to the month, uh, U.S. Open Cup draw today. You guys are in uh, Union Omaha. Just, uh, I guess just what's the – have you guys thought about that yet or just what's the approach to the U.S. Cup uh, right now for you guys? Well, I just got the – I just got uh, – I heard about the result during training, the, the draw. So we're playing Union Omaha again. Again, you know, for me, would it have been nicer to have a, a, an opponent that's closer to us? Yes, but it doesn't seem to work like that this year for me or last year, to be honest. So we know they're a good team in uh, USL League One, uh, and we need to be prepared for that. And I would like, like I said last year, I'd like to, uh, I would like to get the first win in club's history in an Open Cup. I think that our fans are devoted to this tournament. As, as are a lot of U.S. soccer fans in this country. So we're going to, once we get there, we'll approach it. We'll see with our travel. We have Tampa after that, and uh, we'll go there to win.